Well, everybody, we're starting our uh, weekend adventure a little bit early. It's Friday, so it's kind of a technically a three-day weekend. So, and it's Black Friday, so it's going to be an adventure. So we're taking Gabriel out into the world. Don't worry, it's not super early, and hopefully some of the crazies have dissipated. So we're going out into a, a safer world. But anyway, we're gonna let him experience his first Black Friday. So we're actually out in this madness to look for baby clothes and baby stuff on the cheap. Going to Old Navy because they got, they've got good baby clothes. They're generally always pretty inexpensive. Hoping that today we can get a deal. I want to go in there and look at TVs. <laughs> no. I had a feeling that was coming. <laughs> I convinced her to let us go into Best Buy first. There's a 75 inch TV at the front of the store. Bigger than I. Okay, of course we didn't buy anything at Best Buy, but we met up with my sister and her husband, and we're headed to Old Navy. Yep. I like it. Did you show him the line yet? How ridiculous Yeah, I already showed him. I think our baby's over it. No, Look, buddy. totally cool. Look at all the That's stuff That's all you your get. stuff. <laughs> and he's out. Won't sleep in the quiet room in a bed. Take him into a busy old Navy. I think it's the, the mama, mama contact. It's very warm. <laughs> very, very warm. We're in line. Old Navy was a success. We got a lot of the things we needed. Hey. You're adorable. I love you. What was that noise? So now we've had a nap, energized and in a good mood, not looking at the camera at all. <laughs> You're gonna swing yourself right out of this thing. Okay, hopefully this is our last Black Friday stop. We had one small thing we wanted to look for, and Gabriel's hungry and Sarah really didn't want to come in, so I'm going to brave Target alone. I think I can move faster by myself anyway. Gabriel finished eating and Sarah decided she wanted to come in because nobody can resist Target. Man, you got some red cheeks, buddy. We survived Target. Not only did Mama come in, <laughs> she made a purchase. Purchase says, Mama can't resist. Target, it's Target. They Just build it that way. Acts like she didn't want to be here. It's Black Friday, I'm tired, I can't do this anymore. I oh, was not that pitiful. But I need a hoodie. I was more concerned about him eating. And let's go through the shoes real quick. I did get a hoodie. <laughs> she got a hoodie. I only had one and the zipper broke. I needed a hoodie. I got season one of Stranger Things on Blu-ray for 10 bucks. I just stood in line for that. <laughs> now, we're at the mall. Sarah's the one running me around now. It's a rare, rare thing here, people. We dropped Gabriel off with his BB and Papa. 
just fighting a nap, so. That's their problem to deal with. <laughs> There's not a whole lot going on in this mall on Black Friday, which is weird. But I guess it is the Alexandria Mall. But there's not a whole lot going on. Yay! We're going to get down. Alright, we're leaving the Alexandria Mall. Guess what? The only thing we bought here? <laughs> cookies and a pretzel. <laughs> we went to a mall on Black Friday and all we bought was cookies and a pretzel. They didn't have the curling iron I wanted. So it's because it's a door buster and we didn't bust any doors. Well, we survived Black Friday, and now it's uh, travel day Saturday, I guess you'd say, for us. So, car's all loaded. We're about to hit the road here in a few minutes, and hopefully we don't have uh, any excitement <laughs> like we did on the way here. Let's see, what, what DVD do we want to watch? Turn around this way, look. <laughs> wanted us to leave obviously but got to go home sometime so we are headed back hopefully without incident <laughs> no excitement quick pit stop update something is happening down there we don't know what it is but we were driving and a whole bunch of 18 wheelers kind of threw themselves off the highway and drove through the grass like they pulled off the highway <laughs> drove through the grass to get to the frontage road so all the other cars did the same thing several of the cars started following them we stayed on it for just a second and then took the exit like sane people <laughs> And now we're on the frontage road. Driving, I see nothing on the Yeah, road. we're driving parallel to the highway. Y'all are all a 
bunch of lemmings. Hey, I told Sarah, I said, if you see a bunch of wild animals all running in one direction to get away from something, you should run that direction too. You don't know what's coming. All right. We've driven for several miles down the service road and seen nothing. So Sarah was right. It looks like there's nothing going on. I said, that one guy, that one 18-wheeler probably missed his exit, freaked out and just jumped across the, uh, the grass. But the exit was like half a mile down the road. He's watching TV. Everybody got nervous. Oh my God, the guy's jumping on this. We all gotta go. So, and that was you. And I did it too. Better safe than sorry. Update number three. <laughs> Turns out there was something down there. It was a long way away and the service road we were on came to a dead end after we got off. We just noticed that it dead ended. <laughs> and there are no service roads next to us now that we that will take us past this so we are now stuck in traffic. There you go. It's just a police car. He not he's pulling somebody over. Please tell me we're not all driving slow because of that. But do appreciate the beautiful Texas sunset. And our very dirty windshield. Well, everybody, we made it home. It took uh, about an hour to an hour and a half, I guess, longer than it should have. We hit traffic in Texas and stayed in traffic for most of our Texas drive, most of the Texas portion of the drive. So, as you saw, and there were there was never anything, any wrecks or anything like that to see. So, we made it home. Uh, I'm gonna unpack that. Gabriel is getting ready for bed. And I think we're gonna call it here, because uh, even though tomorrow's Sunday, I've gotta do a little bit of yard work, grocery store, and then I'm gonna watch the Saints. So, I don't think we're gonna do anything special. Um, so we're going to cut the video off right here. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and click the bell so you get the notifications. And leave us a comment. Tell us how your Black Fridays went. If you braved the Black Friday crowds. Uh, and if you did, feel free to post a link to your videos. Uh, the video, you know, you took for yourself braving the crowds. So, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time.